So we've got a new area to conquer with the desert area jumping in now. And of course, you know, you have your typical pyramids and wavy background bullshit. There are rumors about an angry sun attacking Taurus. Great. The sun from Super Mario Bros. 3. Who completely pissed me off. That's that guy. And then we have the Bezos or whatever the hell they are. The jumping tiki masks for some reason. Yep. We've got all that in the deserts. I don't understand why those are native to the desert, but hey, okay, kind of look more like Easter Island type statues to me. Hmm. Not sure if I really want to get this, considering I lose it very quickly. And I can't believe I just threw that shell up and managed to hit it with a fireball. Oh, the guy who throws fire is weak to fire. Well, who'd have fucking... who would have known that? Oh, I jump onto the spear. That was stupid. That was really dumb. Anyway, New Year. It's another year, and according to a lot of people, I'm sure that the world is going to end this year because of the Mayan calendar and other bullshit. Cool. Guess we'll guess we'll get to that. Guess we'll cross that bridge when we get there in December, which is a really long time from now. Desert Beach. Isn't that kind of a kind of an oxymoron? A desert beach. Usually deserts are devoid of, of water, minus like oasis, oasises, oasi, something like that. Probably can't jump on the crab. Probably cannot jump on the crab. I don't know, I'm sure there's a desert beach that exists. Oh, you can jump on them. Hmm, can you jump on them regularly though? That's what I want to know. Let's see. Uh, yeah, and he gets really pissed and he starts scuttling really fast. Well, don't jump on a crab. I figured he would just, you know, lose a lose a hit because of his claws, but yeah, you just keep digging those rocks there. You just keep whatever. There are also a lot of football players for this being a desert beach. Not only have I not seen a lot of football players at the at the beach, but a desert beach. Now this must be the place to be. There's like log structures everywhere and random green hills in the background, whatever the fuck those are supposed to be. Crabs and some dude digging up rocks like a dick. It's pretty much the jock beach of of Mario at this point. Those guys suck. If I fall, is it death? No, well, by that point in the game, it's basically death. Look how mad that crab gets. That crab gets super mad and just fucking books it. Wants no part. He wants no part anymore. This has to be the most random desert I've ever been to. There's no way. There's no way that a desert like this exists anywhere with swinging platforms and... Look at how big this sandbar is. You can't even climb this sandbar. It's just a 90 degree angle. That really sucks. Still trying to get Creature House in order. And we were talking about that last night. Death? Oh, might as well be. Yeah, that's pretty much death. We were talking about that the other night. Just still trying to get some stuff in order. Working on it. The faster the better. Because I'd, I'd rather leave and go do that. Instead of stay here and do pretty much the same thing. I don't know, it's just... Why is this... Oh. Is this a free life? Or is it... No, coins? Really? What a shitty reward, coins. That's why I'd never go for the secret. It's always something dumb. And that stupid... The, what do you call it? It's gotta be around here somewhere. The little green victory ball. Oh, cool. He, he gave me an invisible coin blocks and a guy throwing rocks. Holy shit. I gotta... Oh, really? He made this, like, pretty difficult, but not really. Wow. Okay. Well, we're at, we're at this impasse again. But yes, I would I would much rather be there than here. Aren't you gonna miss your friend? Sure. Why not? I'd still rather be there than here. That's for damn sure. There's the green ball of victory. Thank the Lord. We've found the green ball of victory. <clears throat> I wonder how much I wonder if there's an extra world in this hack, like an eighth world. Pretty sure the eighth world is usually just Bowser's world, so. I'll probably be the last one. Now we have floating spikes. And the crabs are still here. It looks like the sun's kind of setting. Oh, look at that. He's got sound effects for his hammers that he throws. Hammer bro's a huge douche. 
He's also a beach jock, even though his hammer seemed to disappear in, uh... Don't even tell me. There's gotta be a way to get out of here. Are you kidding me? If you just fall, you're dead? Well, that's weak. That is really weak. You can't even swim under any of this shit, can you? Fuck that. I'm going back. He doesn't even give you a chance to get up. It's like, oh, you fell. Well, looks like you should kill yourself. Because that's pretty much... I didn't even make it there. Okay. I don't, I don't understand what the point of that was, but sure. Well, I don't understand what the point of that was either. Is there a mushroom here? Yep, there's another mushroom here. Even though we just got one, I, I'm pretty sure. And there is the halfway tape. Checkpoint tape. Okay. How the hell am I supposed to time this? Like that? Is that what you want me to do? Sure, I can, I can do that. Hammer bro, beach jock. Seems like it would be a secret up here. Like that this shouldn't have been found. Or it's just the end. That, that could be true too. You never know. I guess we'll find out. Whenever Toad's done walking to his musicless exit. Secret? No? No, it wasn't even a secret level. Dry, dry desert. So we're coming from... Oh, there's the sun. There's that sun. Wow, you son of a bitch. Now the sun's gonna, gonna attack me. I don't know what kind of sun this is. I don't know if it's the lame one that, like... I don't know. One of them's really weird. Just how it's programmed in. Come on, son. Yeah, like that. He's like Kennedy bullet. He's doing a Kennedy bullet in, like, midair where he stops and changes. Wow, there's... Why are there two of them? There are two of them that I have to deal with now? Who the fuck did I piss off? This is bullshit. Why are there two? There should never be two sons. You could also kill it with a turtle shell in Mario 3. However, that is probably not the case that well, I missed. But in Mario 3, you could kill it with a turtle shell. I know that. Okay, yeah, you're not killing it with the turtle shell. And this one, he is invincible. Or maybe it was a star. I'm pretty sure you could kill it with a turtle shell, though. You son of a bitch. I'm trying to jump under it. Come on, go. Stupid turtle. <laughs> look at that, look at that, he just rises up. Look at that. Oh, there's victory. Sun can't do anything now except for, you know, try and kill me. He just goes right through me because I've got the uh, victory invincibility going. Unless I fall in a hole. Taizo taught us that. If you fall in a hole, then you're still going to die, even if, even if you've got that invincibility going on. And we're back to the beach. You know what I've never seen in a desert, too? Not that I've really been to a lot of deserts. I've never seen a dolphin in a desert. But then again, I could be wrong, and there could be a dolphin in the desert somewhere. How the fuck do I know? I don't. I'm just speculating. Never seen a dolphin in the desert. Well, then you, sir, have not lived. If you've never seen a dolphin in the desert, you've not lived. Never seen flying turtles in the desert either, but, you know, it's a Mario game. It's to be expected. I'll just continue to jump up them and yeah, I hear crab. Most things seem to be weak to fire, which is good. In my case, it is it is very good. So I can just do that and that, and not even care about collecting the stupid coins that they drop. Is this level already done? No. Nope. Still got a little bit more to go. It seems. Just t okay. Yeah, like a like an extra eight seconds. We actually will get to the castle and beat it in this level. Minus all of the dolphin desert, or the desert dolphins. Sorry, I had that a little backwards. Castle 7, and then Mystery Tube. And of course, can't skip this for some I could fast forward it, but... You know, it's really whatever. Listen, it's not, it's not, he went into a castle to be outside. Like, what the... What's up with that? I don't get that. How do you go into a thwimp? That thing didn't hit me. I'm gonna argue that. Thwomp. Thwimp. I'm gonna argue. You do. Oh, well, look at that. You do not argue the thwimp. Are we already at the bar? Oh, now it's an airship. Now it is an airship. And look, I'm also weak to fire. I wonder if these have the. God, you son of a bitch. I wonder if these have the crazy hitboxes, too. I don't think so. A lot of times when these are brought in, they also have the crazy hitboxes that, like, just slaughter you. There won't even be fire near you and you'll die. You die of, like, heat. 
I just ran into these stupid things. These are screwing up my progress quite nicely, if I don't say. They are screwing up my progress pretty well. Can I move this? No. It's not like the screws in Super Mario Bros. 3. You can move them. Some of them. Couldn't move all of them, but some of them, they are movable. They pissed me off. They really, really upset me. They got me killed many times. I don't want to go down there. Seems to be a lot of fire down there. And I am... Oh, you were going the other way. Seems to be a lot of fire up there, too. So I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait a second. Oh, God. This is getting bad. Ugh. This is getting very bad. Look at all the wood. This looks like it's straight out of Mario 3. Except for that hothead, whatever the hell it is. This That part looks like it's straight out of Mario 3. Are we going to fight a magic wand guy or... Turtle shells. Okay, well, chances are I'm going to need these. There's a fucking ghost. Why is the ghost of... Oh, God. Why is the ghost of Snorlax here? Oh, God, what is he throwing? Ugh. He's throwing, like, sperms at me. I don't even know if that hit him, but... Okay, here you go. Have that. Ah! He's already dead. Even the desert and the frightening... Snorlax ghost. We're no problem for Toad. We are now going to the last world. The frightening Snorlax ghost who shoots sperm for some reason. But is it the end yet? Find out. All this and more. Okay, I'm fast forwarding that. I will check this though. I would like to check this to make sure. This is actually a level. Deep Lava Cave 1. Toad start. Alright, this, this looks good. This looks good. Let's see. Notice, heat and glue. Not the best combination. Don't get burned. Heat and glue. Alright, well. When we come back, we'll do the last world and possibly mop this hack up.